left foot out, I already know your butt's out. So I don't have to do this and keep looking at their butt. So I only have to look at that front foot to know if it's straight. So let's do another halt, so it's close again, and see if you can get all four feet completely lined up, your two and her front two. What did you say? So foos, okay. and then when you stop, I want all four feet lined up, your two and her two. So right now, look where your front feet are by her back feet. Okay. Yeah, she's got good focus. That, I would say. All right, let's bring her over. This is for everybody. That, the last time I saw her until now, oh, that's yeah, just well, that's really you know, good. She's such a good teacher. I mean, well, yeah. And the thing I like, so you see that foot's out, though? I wouldn't pay. You guys see that chair example yeah. right there? So you see that left foot's out, which means her butt's out. So your spine is facing me. Her spine is facing me. So can you tell her in and pull her back a little bit? Now it's straight. She's a little bit forged, but it's straight. That's, that's exactly right. So, um, there's something that we do called a backwards box. I don't know if she's familiar, but Sherry's, Sherry, she's on my program, so I know exactly what to do, which is always nice. So let's use the fence line. Um, can you come over here so everybody can see it? So if you guys want to see what I'm talking about, now we're getting into the more advanced. Um, bring her right here with uh, her butt facing them. So she's facing this way. All right, easy baby, I'm approaching. She's friendly, right? Oh yeah. Um, you see how there's two rings on the prong collar. This is called the dead ring. Was that a growl or a burp? Oh no, that wasn't a growl. <laughs> no, you won't. She doesn't growl. So right here, this one is the dead ring. I always get nervous. You can tell I've been bit too many times. So. Your short leash will go on that uh, ring there, which you already have it on. Your long leash, this one, you're going to hook to the dead ring, this one. Does that make sense? So, here. Can you guys see how that looks? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right? As Sherry showed you this part. Yeah. No, this one no, this is, yeah. That so, this is how we start teaching the ends. So, this is exactly how we start teaching the ends. So, you're going to say in and face me. And both of you turn and both of you face me. And pull with that right okay. hand. Right. Yes. Girl. And pay, even though it's a little crazy. Great. <laughs> so now we start the backwards healing. So now we have her right next to a fence line and your hands are the same. And we use the word back. Back. And you're gonna, this hand is for this way. The left hand is for this movement. And I'll show you how this works on a prong in a second. This hand here is for the butt coming in, plus we use a fence line. So you're going to go sit, she squeezes against the fence line, and you're going to go back with both hands, just like you have. Right when her front feet go backwards, you're going to pay. Bring her right to the fence line. But now look what, and let her relax a second. Look at what Joelle has that's nice. She has eye contact. Mm -hmm. Now I can work with you. This is what I'm talking about, the focus. So even though I don't know this dog, the trainer trains with me and it's on the exact same program. So I know the steps, everything's about steps. All right, so now let's uh, squeeze her again and let's do it. Uh, yeah, that one behind, and then you can see back. Now do I move back? Yeah, you both move back. Back. And pull with that, both back. hands a little bit. Back. So, yep, back. with the right hand pull. Back. Okay, I'll show you. She's Come here, stuck. baby. You're stuck against the fence. You know, watch what my right hand does. I'm not going to ask her to look at me because she doesn't know me. I'm just going to show you the leashes. Back, 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 back. Yeah. You okay. see how she jumped back? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. But I was putting some pretty good pressure. So I click so you can pay her. Let me do one more for you. So this is how we start her backwards healing. And I'm going to explain why we do backwards healing. Yep, click. Hey, girl. All right, now you Great. do it. <laughs> yeah. 
Yes. Good girl. Oh, sorry. No, you're right. <laughs> she hopped back. I got excited. So now it's time for plots and relax. Oh, you can bring it out of the mud. Plots and relax. So just think of your informal command. So now we're going to talk so she can just relax. We do something, and she won't be ready for this for another four weeks. In fact, run it by Cherry before you do. We call this a backwards box. Picture an orange square, 15 feet by 15 feet by 15 by 15. So just orange paint on this grass. Legs like tracking, one and three or four, two and four or backwards. So leg one moves forward. Leg two, backwards. Leg three, forward. Leg four, backwards. What are you going to do? Really work on that rear end. Okay. That keeps the rear end from doing what? Kicking out. Where you're like tripping on. Can you picture a backwards box? Once she learns backwards this, and you can go like 15, 20 steps, maybe five weeks, I would start that. She's obviously not ready for it until like five weeks. All right, let's see what else she has. This sit in motion, a beach sit, a plus recall. Yeah, but will she, uh, can you do a sit first? And she'll stay in her sit? Okay, let me see. So on this next <laughs> one, we'll do it again. I when you stop, before you, you take off, make sure all four feet. No, That's they mailed me the, the, the big long box. It didn't have the jump in it? I don't know. Do, do we have it here? Yeah. So so it I would put both leashes behind oh, like the door. Like that. She has it yeah. now. So now let's draw a home like that. Let's see if it's in Stop and pull with that right hand. I want to. There, now it's sit. Now look at her spine when you walk away. Sit. Sit. Can you guys see the difference? Mm -hmm. This is points right A lot straighter. Right now. I, I now come back. You were a little bit drunk driving. You were a little bit drunk driving. She was 100% lined up. Have pay when you like it. So now let's do the same thing on the plots. So it's both hands like this. Make sure she's lined up when you hold. And then say plot after the hold. Good. Don't walk to your right or it's going to look crooked. You're walking to your right a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to have to put a second leash. Now you see it straight. Now call her when you want. Where are you going to that line? It's to the Alright, now let's play it. I want to see what you're talking about, Mike. You guys have You guys have one. I got this from Dawson. So go to toy number three first, then two, then one. One back? Yes. We'll start with the longest favorite toy. Man, I didn't know to bring all the toys. What's that? I said I didn't know to bring all the toys. How many toys did you bring? Her balls, pretty much. I don't think I even brought her tug. Can you hand me the... Oh. Okay. Where's the... 